They just don't make them like they used to. This adage applies to this light bulb, which has literally been flickering longer than Henry Kissinger, who just turned 100, has been alive. It has been glowing over this garage in California's Livermore Pleasanton Fire Department since 1901. 1901, we believe, is when the light bulb was donated by um, Dennis Bernal, who owned the Livermore Power and Water Company. And he was going out of business, he was selling his business, and he donated the light bulb to the fire department. Retired Deputy Fire Chief Tom Brammel should know he's affectionately known as the Guardian of Light. You're not allowed to touch it, by the way. We don't even dust it off. He was surprised five years ago when the thing had been burning at that point for only one million hours. After being around the bulb for 50 years, Brammel says he's only aware of a couple times it has been out, a major one in 2013 after he'd already been retired for a decade. Oddly enough, it wasn't the light bulb, it was a, an uninterrupted power supply. What we did is we bypassed the UPS system with an extension cord at that time and a light bulb came back on. Other things this little light outshone, World Wars I and II, the moon landing, 22 presidents, even a global pandemic. The durable light bulb was made in Shelby, Ohio, and made its mark in the Guinness Book of World Records, Ripley's Believe It or Not, and General Electric. It puts out about four watts uh, of light, but it's a 60-watt light bulb that Shelby uh, Electric had de developed. It's hand-blown, the filament is carbon filament, and the filament is uh, about half the size uh, thickness of your hair. Small, mighty, and durable, enough to stand the test of time. I suspect that this light bulb will continually burn another 100 years. For Inside Edition Digital, I'm Stephanie Officer.